a dog with braces, liquid nitrogen ice cream, and that time the dumb Daniel meme went too far. Hey guys, welcome to Weird This Week. I'm your host, Carly Henderson, and let's get weird. Ah, uh, braces. Anyone else have any awkward photos like these? As a former brace face, let me tell you, it's totally worth it. Did you know dogs can actually get braces too? An adorable golden retriever named Wesley made it big on the interweb this week when his brace face was exposed. The poor little fluffball couldn't close his mouth when his teeth came in, so his dad, who just happens to be a doggy dentist, those exist, put on some braces. Now, dogs shouldn't get them for aesthetic purposes, but if a dog is in pain, they say, brace away. Ah, uh, dogs, they're just as awkward as us. Metal mouths unite. <laughs> Have you guys heard of places that use liquid nitrogen to create ice cream before your eyes? Molecular gastronomy. Science. And it's a good excuse to throw some Nutella into science. Chelsea and I went to Ice Cream Lab to give ice cream chemistry a try. Ice cream? You scream. We all scream for ice cream. So we're here with Joseph, the owner of Ice Cream Lab. What's the deal with liquid nitrogen ice cream? We make every single cup of ice cream fresh from scratch. So we use liquid nitrogen when freezing ice cream, which allows us to kind of make crazy flavors and do whatever we want. So what are you going to make us first? So first, we're going to start off with my personal favorite. It's called the vanilla, which is basically our vanilla bean ice cream, uh, fresh bananas, and vanilla wafers. Yum. So it's kind of like a banana cream oh pie, gosh. but it's got the crunch vanilla so wafers in I'm it. So it's really it. good. All right, so oh see here, you have, you have a, your basic ice cream. Oh, this is off the bus here. Yeah, that looks so good. Mm. So good. Mm. So Carly and I have a really good idea. What's that? What do you think about us making some of our own concoctions? That's fine. I just I can't promise you I'm gonna eat it. Hey, uh, we're gonna make them right eat it. All right, let's get this thing started. I'm gonna come over to this table and choose some interesting items. I think I'm gonna go for pizza, but I, it's kind of like salty and Are cheesy. you sure about that? Oh okay. yeah. I kind of want to put it with Nutella. Ooh, what I think, think? that'd be good. Let's give it a shot. All right. Yeah. Ice, ice, Here goes nothing. I swear it's gonna be good. Ice, ice, baby. Oh my, stop. Keep the Nutella ice cream coming up. Here it comes. Oh my god. Whoa. Honest opinions, thoughts, what's going through your head? It's honestly just kind of confusing <laughs> because pizza's not supposed to have this texture. I just got a chunk of crust. How about you score it? So that one I'd give a five. <laughs> for five points for creativity. I'd give it a six. I'm gonna give it a four. <laughs> I would never eat that again. I really love Cheetos. Good. I really love baked beans. And then I think we should top it with a little bit of a Pickle! <laughs> Some fresh baked beans. <laughs> you got this, you got this, Charlie. Oh, this one doesn't get all Right. Oh, oh, there's a chunk of a Cheeto right there. It smells really cheesy, yeah. actually. It smells like McDonald's. I you kind of like the, it. You can taste the beans more than the Cheetos. Uh, in mine, I can taste the Cheetos better. I can taste the Cheetos more. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm crunching away over here. <laughs> <laughs> this one I give a six. I'm gonna give this one a six. I'm gonna go with the six as well. You're like what ten. Grab some pickle. Carly. All right, all right. Ah! Pickle down. No. No. Huh. I love pickles. I love Cheetos. I love ice cream, but not the gummy. Oh yeah. That looks yeah. so good. That looks so good. <laughs> Um, um, good. So. That's like the best ice cream I've ever had. I'm gonna give this one a 10. I'm gonna give it yeah. an eight and a half. But I want halves round up to holes, so she gives it a nine. Okay. I'm gonna give it a nine too, that was really good. Right. Thank you guys for coming by. Yes, yeah. thank you. You guys should probably just go away now. There's a lot of eating to do. <laughs> you guys, I'm still swearing you should try popcorn caramel stuffed in a donut. <gasps> Yum. Now recently, everyone was kind of obsessed with Dam Daniel. Dam Daniel. Dam Daniel. Back at it again with the white van. But like all things, some people just take it to the next level. A guy named, wait for it, Daniel. Dam Daniel. Liked this meme so much, he permanently inked it on his 
skin. Hairy little guy, I'm not quite sure what body part that's on. And he's also got the dress tattooed on his leg. And I mean, I also found another guy with a damn Daniel tattoo. <gasps> Damn, I hope you love it because that is not going away anytime soon. Back at it again with the tattoos that last forever. Would you guys ever tattoo a meme? And do you have any weird but delicious flavor combos that you love? Not pizza, never pizza. Definitely let me know what you think about that pooch rocking the braces. Hit me up in the comments below. And if you guys like this video, I hope you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. For hollywire.com, I'm your host, Carly Henderson, and until next week, keep it weird. For more weird this week, click the box on the left, and to see me try to survive in the wild, click the box on the right, and don't forget to subscribe.